Okay, so if you need to make your own grading skill, because for example, you are doing standards based grading um, and you want to change the standard skill, this is how you're going to do it. Um, you need to pay really close attention because if you do this wrong, your grades will not sink into Aries. So pay attention. So you're gonna go to grade set, set up, you're gonna go to add and you're gonna add a scale. Um, leave it on percentage, and I'm going to call this like standard based grading. I'm going to name it two because I already have one in there. Um, two. You're going to add, so I'm going to add in my letter grades here. They do need to be the same letter grades that um, a typical scale has. So A, B, C, D, E, F. Um, what's going to be easiest here is going to be use average for the letter conversion. Um, so an A on our standard base is 85 to 100, a B is that 70 to 85, a C is the 55 to 70, a D starts at 40, and an F will stay at zero. So you can see it's auto filling the max here. This letter conversion does not really mean anything. It just means that, um, say you were to use this scale for an assignment, and then you'd select A on the assignment. Now it's actually going to numerically process as a 92. I do not recommend doing that. I recommend for all of your assignments, use numeric. Okay, that way you can give um, percents. What this will do is then convert. When you, your students have their final grade, say it's calculated and they are at an 82, 82 falls in this range, they're going to be given a B or a 71, they'll be given a B. And that's going to pull into Aries. They will also see that as their final grade. So what you're going to do is save changes. Oops, letter conversion must fall. Oh, this one. So we'll just put this at 30, for example. So now when you go to this final grade setting, you're going to want to have that one. We'll select the one we just made. And then you're going to want to save here. Make sure that when you are on here, you still have numeric starred because this starred one is going to be the automatic one for all your assignments. What you wanted to change is this final grade settings here with that scale you made. And it's always good too to click on it just to make sure here you are converting to letter grades. No letter grades, no, it will not sink into Aries at the end of the grading period, and that's when you're going to have problems. So that is how you will create your own skill, though, if you are not going to use 712 standard. If you um, use the standard scale, we already have that for you in there, 7th to 12th grade standard, and you can select it. So go ahead and make sure you save changes, and now you should be good to go. You will have to do that for each of your courses. Um, that you need that scale for.